holidays are a great time to read new books. Here's a few of my favorites. Educated by Tara Westover. It's interesting that she's such a good writer. I mean, to go from growing up in Idaho, homeschooled, and I'm just gonna do what my dad says, to being a Cambridge PhD, she not only found her way out, she found her way out with a lot of self-respect and immense capability. Yuval Noah Harari's 21 Lessons for the 21st Century. He's a really strong thinker. He makes it clear that big problems, they're not solvable by a single country. The human mind wants to worry about the dilemmas we face today. This book is a better framework for all this worrying that people are doing. Andy Puttycomb's Meditation and Mindfulness. Well, when you meditate, they sometimes say, empty your mind, but that really never happens. So his analogy is, the idea is they're like clouds coming across your head. You should just push them away gently. If he gets people doing 10 minutes daily meditation, I think that's fantastic. Paul Cherie's Army of None. It's a very thoughtful book. It's about what armies are gonna look like in the future now that we have amazing software. Should a drone be able to go out and find enemies and attack them? And should the US have these autonomous weapons? Should the software be letting the humans make the decisions or not? And he's very cautionary that we need to hold back and not go all the way to robotic warfare. We should not give up human involvement in these weapons. Bad Blood by John Kiryu. This is a thriller with a tragic ending. It's his story of a Silicon Valley startup, Theranos. They were doing diagnostics, and people were excited because Elizabeth Holmes, the founder, was young and energetic. Yes, great diagnostics will eventually come. They can be very cheap, not need as much blood, read out even your DNA. But when it all was revealed, they really didn't have what they were talking about. In fact, they'd been giving patients diagnoses that were actually dangerous because they were so wrong. Well, I'm looking forward to reading over the holidays. I hope you like the selections I've talked about here.